before. For my 30th birthday, my boyfriend and family came to visit me in Florence for a week. My family members from all over the world flew in to celebrate together. The day before my birthday, my boyfriend proposed to me on Ponte Vecchio at sunrise, and it was the most beautiful and romantic day I have ever had. To commemorate the moment, we stopped by a street-side photo booth and took some pictures. Later that day, we would share the good news with my family. Everyone congratulated us, cried, sang, danced, and embraced. It was a special moment I know we will never forget. The room had a lively and festive atmosphere, not unlike Peter Bruegel the Younger's Festa di Nozze in the Casa Contadina. After The world is full of uncertainty. I can't be sure when I will be able to see my family again and to embrace them. In difficult times, we often feel most comforted by being closer with those we love. Unfortunately, this virus makes it so exactly that which feels most natural in these hard times is what we cannot do. Bruegel's painting, completed in 1564, shows common people enjoying a wedding celebration. Each figure interacts with another, which energizes the pictorial plane. In it, we see our most basic desires depicted, the love of music, movement, and the need for connection. Now, I find myself looking at photos and videos from my birthday and engagement celebrations. Hearing the songs, laughter, and the clinking of glasses transports me to what now feels like another world. Perhaps Bruegel the Younger's painting, which he produced to celebrate his marriage, had the same effect of uplifting his spirits when he saw it after its completion. Whether it be a painting, photo, or a poem, art helps transport us to another world when we need an escape. Thank you.